Guy Harvey, artist, scientist, angler, diver, conservationist, and family man. Journey with Guy to the world's greatest fishing waters, where every fish, every fight is a window on another world. Where every catch is a portrait from the deep waiting to be painted. Go exploring with Guy in the last wild country under the waves. Having fished in some of the best fishing destinations this planet has to offer, in my experience, Tropic Star Lodge in Panama is at the very top. This great angling adventure made news in the world's leading sport fishing journals in that Neil Patrick gave up a potential 50 pound class IGFA world record so we could add to our knowledge of the life history of the black marlin in the eastern Pacific Ocean. After months at sea, we now know where this great fish went. The person coordinating this research effort is Dr. Mike Dermeyer. Guy, what a great story that makes, that 1,200 pounder and how that thing finally got to the boat by you swimming down and clipping on a heavier leader. Otherwise, I don't think you ever would have seen that fish, or if you did, it probably would have been dead. But you guys got it to the boat, Wit put one of my tags in it, and we did get a good track off that fish. It swam straight down to Columbia, and in fact, it's not the only fish we've tagged here that's gone to Columbia. I've had two or three go down to Columbia. And then it came back up this way, and it came off somewhere off the Panama Canal. So if it had been a conventional tag, we wouldn't have known how much it moved. But being one of these, these data logging satellite tags, we knew that it made a pretty significant move before the fish actually lost its tag. Having 50 pound tackle on, we realized that we would have to get this fish up quickly to put a, an archival satellite pop-up tag in it. Well, this is a big ask with 50 pound tackle. So somehow, Guy dove down, attached an 80 pound line to the leader, and Bill Shedd transferred to my boat, and together we tried to raise the fish quickly to have it in good condition. This, of course, wipes out any thought of any IGFA records. And when it came out of the water, right at the stern of the boat, I was amazed. Having Guy Harvey and his crew next to me while I was fighting this fish was beyond belief. Fancy having a photographer and an underwater photographer near me. Reviewing the photographs and the video of this fish and Guy having got an accurate short length measurement on it, I consider this fish easily to be a 1300 pounds. When we decided to tag the fish, I had no thought of world records, but even so, I think I would have tagged it anyway, particularly as I had the International Game Fish Association Fisheries Conservation Committee, Bill Shedd, myself and Guy Harvey, involved with this incredible fish. Tagging this fish with a satellite pop-up archival tag was the best fishing experience in my entire life. I love fishing. The black marlin is, and always will be, one of the great ocean predators that I've come to know and respect. It's our collective responsibility to conserve these magnificent sea creatures for future generations.